Hey everybody, my name is Kevin Parkinson and I want to give a huge thank you to the Black College Expo. It was back in 2005 when I graduated Bellflower High School in Bellflower, California that I thought to myself, I really want to go to a four-year traditional college. I've been taking college classes at the neighboring community college since I was in 10th grade. And the traditional educational system in community college, as great as it is for some, just didn't work for me. So I moved to West Covina to live with my mother and I started attending the Mount San Antonio Community College. There at a college expo, I met Teresa Price. Did not even know that she was Teresa Price. And in a few days, she got back with me and told me about a few schools that had great mass comm departments. Shaw University in Raleigh, North Carolina was one of them. Well, sure enough, she made a phone call from me and I got a phone call from Shaw University asking that I send over my official high school transcripts. I was nervous, but I did it anyways. And on a payphone while at the campus of Mount San Antonio Community College in between classes, I was accepted to Shaw University. I was jumping around and people thought I was just a crazy kid on a payphone, but they had no idea what just happened. Shortly after, I packed my bags, I left for college. I had to forge my mom's signature because she had never heard of Shaw University and was afraid of me going all the way to the other side of the country alone with no family. But where there's a will, there's a way. And she ended up coming with me and helping me register the first day. The rest is history. I had a wonderful college experience at Shaw University and I would never take back my experience at HBCU. I graduated cum laude as the president of the Mass Comm Department and was accepted with a partial scholarship to the Savannah College of Art and Design, where I received my Master of Fine Arts in Film and Television Producing and Directing. Today, I'm still a motion picture director. I'm getting up to catch a plane in the next hour, actually, to Raleigh, North Carolina, where I'll be shooting a music video for Drake London's new song, You Don't Know. Also, I'm a career advisor during the day. I have a passion to help people find their goals and their passion, just like someone helped me find mine. And I even wrote a book about it. It's called The Art of the Flip, How to Successfully Succeed in Job Interviews. Pick up a copy on Amazon today. My story is unique to me, but it's not unique to the hundreds and thousands of kids the College Expo has helped all over the world. I encourage anybody who can to continue to donate and support the organization and to all the people out there who have a dream of higher education, take a look at the resources that the College Expo provides. They're wonderful, they're fantastic, and take it from me, they do work. I remember being in my career counselor's office back in high school and I didn't have the best SAT scores. It was just found out that I was dyslexic. And I was told maybe the best thing for me is just to go to a community college for the first two years. I was devastated. I didn't want that. I wanted what I saw on TV. I wanted to go to Hillman. I wanted to be on a different world. And because of people like Teresa Price, that dream happened. It wasn't easy. There's a lot of hard work and nothing's given to you. But always know that there's a hand somewhere that's willing to pull you up. Thank you, College Expo, and thank you, everybody who believes that everybody deserves a chance at education.